Thing. Well, I was going to say, uh, over the next couple of days, everything you said is going to, to I knew it. it one way, shape, or another. <laughs> uh, this morning, the front is moving through as we speak, and what's interesting is the temperature went up a couple of degrees just from last hour. However, the humidity has dropped out. Now, as the front moved on through, uh, you can kind of see this on radar, this line right in here. It there may be a little sprinkle out there. Uh, most of it is obviously well off to the northeast. Temperatures, 53 Kerrville, 56 in Comfort, and then 68 here in town. And look at the dew points. Now, we have actually dropped down. We were up in the about low, almost mid-60s just last hour. So dry air is starting to work in here. The really dry air will continue to move on in here and also those slightly cooler temperatures. So I think we're going to be dropping down uh, by to about 60 this morning here in town. Obviously cooler in the Hill country and the wind has already started to shift around out of the north primarily and it is going to be breezy, especially the first portion of the day, about 15, 20 mile per hour winds and then uh, things will be settling down somewhat later on this afternoon. Mold is on the low side this morning. And throughout the rest of today, 70 at noon, 75 for high temperature. Again, early this morning, the gustier winds, they do settle down. A gorgeous day, that lower humidity, even though we're going to be on the above normal side as far as temperatures are concerned. Very chilly start tomorrow, and then a beautiful day. And it's going to start to warm up, though, late in the day. And then we got some big changes coming about here, which do include really good rain chances. That's about the best news, I think, with the forecast. Details on that coming up in just a couple of minutes. Time saver traffic right now.